Mike Jackson tells Automotive Digest how AutoNation, as a publicly traded company, could centrally manage hundreds of dealers, deal with Wall Street, and deliver a peerless customer service experience at a profit. Mike Mooney and I, my partner in running this enterprise, had an approximately 10-year vision. We said uh, to create a peerless customer experience and the operating systems to deliver on it year in, day in, day out, uh, it would probably be a 10-year journey with everything that had to go with it. Now, you say as a publicly traded company, who has the patience to wait around 10 years to see the, play, the payoff? And also, we're in a cyclical business that clearly has its ups and downs. And um, at, at times, you're going to be out of favor with Wall Street. So we said, you know what? We need partners. We need investors who are with us for the long term and understand the opportunity uh, and the payoff that, being, uh, that comes with being us for the long term. So uh, we're in a relatively short period of time. Uh, we have two investors uh, who alone uh, have been with us 13 years and own over 60% of the company. And um, uh, we don't give guidance, so I'm not bound in what I say about the industry or the uh, or automotive outlook. It doesn't have to be tied back to our guidance. That's very liberating. And so in the journey, when we're out of favor, we buy the stock ourselves. And uh, if you add it all up over this past decade, we've repurchased $7 billion worth of outstanding shares at an average price of $17 a share for a stock that's now trading at almost $49 a share. So those long-term long shareholders who stayed with us have been paid off or rewarded is a better word. They're still with us very nicely.